Hey everyone, my name is Nolan, and today I am extremely tired. I, there's like no real reason other than I just haven't had a lot of sleep the last few days. Um, and I know I'll get into this later while I'm doing the gameplay, so I'm not wasting your guys' time right now. But we got a new trader's van today. I have all the weapons right here, and most of these are pretty dang overpriced. I will just say, right off the bat, I have raw might be the best one to get. However, usually when I give these suggestions, I turn out to be wrong sometimes. I will just say, though... A gladiator is still not worth it okay it's not worth the amount of gems it, it's just not the, that good of a sniper at all there's way better snipers for spamming just don't buy this weapon if you have like the same amount of gems as me it's not worth it but other than that nuclear rifle might be pretty good and this one's got an 85 mobility so we'll just kind of jump into games right now to see how good these weapons are so yeah guys um <clears throat> wow excuse me uh if you guys want to see more pixel gun 3d content like this make sure to smash the like button and also consider subscribing so you guys don't miss a, a video from me and turn on notifications so you guys don't miss a trader's van video or something like uh just that happens in the game you know you never know what might happen so this weapon already i can tell it's ammo just kind of sucks it's not really that good um, it chews through ammo pretty dang fast, which is kind of unfortunate and looks like it still kind of takes like a lot of shots to kill someone Looks like you might be able to get about two kills for per clip uh, Also, just before I continue I want to say all my modules on these weapons are level 7 So it's it's not gonna give like over over the top level gameplay But it'll give kind of mid tier gameplay so that way you guys can kind of understand what's going on But yeah, basically uh, Why I'm so tired and why I haven't made a video in a couple days. Wow. What the heck? Um Recently, uh, well, actually not recently. Basically, my friend's getting married this Saturday. Um, so I'm gonna be generally inactive over the next week because I'm just gonna be, like, doing stuff to prep for his wedding because I'm the best man in his wedding. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I, uh, am getting ready for his wedding. And, um, the, this last weekend was the bachelor party. And, um, I know I kind of talked about this a long time ago. You guys might remember it um a lot of you guys might not might not though it was kind of like in one of these kind of videos where i was like doing a story thing um i'll just say yes really quick dude i'm in a i'm in a i'm even though i'm tired i'm still like in a good mood <laughs> um but yeah so i was like um i had planned the bachelor party we were just basically going camping a lot of stuff fell through i won't get into all the details right now but yeah we were just kind of going camping so nuclear rifle is all right it's nothing too crazy that, and that's like the best way to describe it okay this has area damage um i just wanted to test that really quick uh yeah so here we have the big bang revolver right and is there anything special about it no just area damage can you three cat with it oh you can three cat with this thing okay that's kind of interesting um so this might actually be worth it but anyways as i was saying um yeah we were going camping went to a local park um it was just an overnight trip uh we did a fire we did um we just stayed in a trailer my grandpa let it my grandpa let us use his trailer um it was really fun did some fishing did some swimming there, there was a lot to do actually we we crammed a lot into like the one day that we had and it was a lot of fun it was pretty fun but basically i'm so tired we were in the sun the entire well it was it wasn't actually like one day because we stayed overnight so it was two days technically so i was in the sun the entire two days i was there which i know you guys are like oh youtuber goes outside but i'm like, I'm like well normally when i do go outside it's not all day long in 100 degree weather so it's very tiring <clears throat> and on top of that we i just we just didn't get a lot of sleep so i mean it's camping it's not luxury living but so yeah i'm just tired i i might ha be having like some kind of like allergic reaction right now i mean that's why i keep like clearing my throat because there, it, my throat feels weird um yeah this all this weapon also just seems kind of mid it doesn't seem like ridiculously bad it doesn't seem ridiculously good but I'm also like, I also don't think I'm using it right. But today, today, even though I am kind of feeling in a good mood, every single time I die to ultimate him today, I'm just reminded about how much I absolutely despise this game. Like, this guy has only killed me with ultimatum. It's so unskilled, dude. I don't care what anyone says. If you claim to be a pro pixel gun uh, player and you use ultimatum, you're not that good, okay? Ultimatum is a free kill all every single time you use it. You don't have to aim that much with it. Um, you don't have to reload with it. It's really not that skilled of a weapon. So, like, if you get kills with it, so can everyone. It's not that skilled. <sighs> you know what not everyone can do? Melee switch. That's the true test of skill right there. And then, uh, I said that to, like, a pro dude once, and he's like, Okay, well, you try go playing duels without ultimate. And I'm like, that's exactly my point. You can't... Ah, uh, you, you get my point there. I just, I can't take it. Okay, let's move on to werewolf. Pause now. Pause now. 
Um, yeah, these these weapons might be kind of good. I actually have no idea how what these weapons are like at all. Um, they're kind of goofy though. Like, what 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 werewolf would attack with both paws? I actually wait. You know what? That would make sense. Werewolves like pounce, right? I mean, not like obviously cats pounce, but like pic picture like a wolf jumping at its prey. It would use both paws, right? So, I guess it kind of makes sense. I don't know why I'm talking about this. I just don't really have a lot to talk about. Why is this guy always in my game, dude? Why is this guy always in my game? This guy, this trying new claw guy, is always in my game. And he always uses ultimatum, too. He hasn't used ultimatum yet, but I guarantee in, like, 3, 2, 1, we'll see an ultimate. No? Okay. I guess not. Um, but, yeah, dude. I just, I can't take this. I, ew, he had an ultimatum right there. He had an ultimatum right there. Um, so yeah, I, I am just gonna say though, this, this, this updates balance changes, I actually like, I actually like more than dislike. I know a lot of people hate the sniper changes, but it's like, at the same time, why? They, they've balanced the game. A lot of snipers, like, now have around the same damage, and so that I can appreciate. Weapons like Mammoth, they didn't need to be nerfed. They just didn't need to be. They weren't ridiculously OP or everything, or anything, so it's like, not really, like, worth it or anything. Dude, what is this guy's- Come here! Dude, okay, so the fact that, like, this guy can walk backwards with other weapons and, like, outrun me just, like, shows you, like, what I mean when I say that, like, why you need a fast melee weapon. Like, you just need faster melee weapons and flamethrowers because it's so easy to outrun other players in this game and then it just puts you at a huge disadvantage. So, like, if you're not using an 85-plus mobility melee weapon, you're at a huge disadvantage already. Same with flamethrowers. Like, uh, Echo Scanner and uh, what, Like Absorber, I think, now have 85 mobility, which is a really good thing because, um, yeah, this this ain't worth 800. Yeah, this ain't worth 800 gems at all in the slightest. Like, it's it's all right, but it, it's not that good. It's not 800 gems good. Like, how much is that? Like, 20 bucks? That's not worth it in the slightest. All right, now we have this, like, Umbrella Flamethrower, which I'm assuming was probably nerfed recently because this is a bot weapon, and bot weapons tend to get nerfed. Holy cow. Whoa. <laughs> uh, I really hope that guy had, like, low-level armor because this weapon might be really, really good. Okay. So this weapon actually like does a lot of damage. Is that what I'm seeing here? Is that what I'm seeing here? Come here, someone, someone come. Okay, you just spawned in. Let me kill you. Okay, looks like it might have kind of mid-tier damage because, oh, I can't rocket jump with this thing. Dude, see, like I have to get right next to this guy and I can't get right next to him because he's up here. Come here, bro. Come here, bro. Let me kill you. Eh, it's all right. It's not like ridiculously OP. It's just another flamethrower. But look at the range on this thing. Like, so if I, like, if I stand, like, uh, okay, back up, I can't hit him right here. I, I'm right next to him, and I can't hit him, which is super annoying. So it's, like, flamethrowers, like, what's the mobility on this? 75, which is decent, but like I said earlier, almost any weapon, like, still is going to be able to outrun that. Like, all the play all players have to do is walk away, and eventually they'll get out of the range of me. And it's just so frustrating. Like, these need to have a super high mobility or a longer range than this. Like, it's just, it's just not that good. And this flamethrower... It's not bad. Like, these weapons... None of these weapons are, like, bad. But they're just not, like, worth it. <laughs> they're not worth it. Like, there's better flamethrowers than this. There's way better flamethrowers than this. So, why would you buy this? That's my that's my thing. It's alright. I, I don't know. I think I should probably just move on to Gladiator. Because, like, there's really not much else to say. It's just your flamethrower. Like, there you go. Flamethrower. Is there anything else I need to show? Really? Anything else you guys need to see about this? I'm watching your vid right now. You're watching my Trader's Van vid? Bros from the future, maybe? Bros from the future right now? That's crazy, dude. All right, let's try out Gladiator, shall we? Gladiator was buffed recently by quite a dang bit, but as you guys will quickly find out, it's still not that great. Like, it is pretty decent now. It's like just another sniper, you know? You can spam with it, you can get kills with it, but it's nothing like groundbreaking. Uh, a lot of players 3-cat in this game, so why would you 3-cat? And, or why would you get this sniper when a lot of, like, almost like everyone three cats. If you guys use, like, spamming snipers, still this isn't a good choice for, like, spamming. Um, because, like, there's just way better spamming snipers. Like, laser carbine, I, I go with laser carbine over this every, every day. Any day. That's a, that's like a two-shot sniper, right? It's a two-shot sniper, high fire rate, and if you wanted, you could use it with three cat because it has high enough damage. So, yeah, this, uh, this trader's van is, like, pretty dang bad. There's no way... I'm in second place, though, with Gladiator, which is absolutely mind-blowing. That's crazy, dude. Um, so I think that usually this is going to be, like, about a three-shot, which is kind of all right. Um, and it also is kind of, like, easy to hit shots. What I've noticed is, like, the rocket has a pretty high hitbox. Like, 
like whatever that thing is has a pretty high hitbox but i'm pretty sure i just four shot that guy so it looks like it might be like a three to four shot usually which is i guess better than it used to be like what was this buff by like 33 percent no that was warmaster i don't really know maybe this didn't even have a damage buff it just had like a travel rocket speed buff or something so i don't really know this weapon uh it's, it's like nothing too special uh, you can get this with coupons i'm pretty sure you can buy all these weapons with coupons i bought the first three weapons with coupons and uh coupons are just kind of like better to spend instead of gems because you can spend gems on like anything everything in this game but you can only spend coupons on weapons so yeah okay the final weapon here is eye of raw and it's got 85 mobility so i'm expecting this to be kind of good and also it has a long charge time so i'm expecting it to not have to like charge up all the way in order to one shot which Hopefully is the case, because this charge time is ridiculously long, and from what I've seen so far, yeah, you don't have to fully charge it to one shot, which is convenient. Also, it looks like it has a pretty dang high ammo. Oh, actually, not really. Its ammo is, oh, of course, self-destruct. Looks like it takes about uh, 15 rounds for every charge shot. So, what's 15 divided by 90? Like, I think it's 6. I, I think it's 6. I'm pretty sure it's 6. So, you got about 2 shots in here. That wasn't a one shot. Please burn. Please burn! No, he's not burning. Okay, so it looks like it might not one-shot ultimate defense armor users, which is annoying. Um, but it does still do pretty decent damage. But, like, that was, like, a full charge, right? Was that, like, a full charge? So that killed him. Let's see if this will kill him. Uh, not even a full charge. Boom. Still killed him, and he has dev armor. So, looks like it does do pretty good damage. So... I mean, I, like I said earlier, I'm pretty sure this is going to be the best weapon you can get in the trader's van. On top of that, I'm pretty sure this weapon might be kind of rare. I don't really follow rare weapons anymore. All I know is that Desert Fighter is rare. That's it. Um, I don't know any other rare weapons that like a lot of players don't have. But apparently people are telling me this weapon's kind of rare. So that might kind of like justify getting it. Because, you know, it might not come back again. But um, Oh, also, I guess technically like the new uh, anniversary weapons would be rare. Because, um... Those are like exclusive exclusives, so um, they should, they're not supposed to come back. They are not supposed to come back ever, but we all know the devs. They'll probably, they'll probably bring them back. I mean, you can't take my word. I just say what the devs tell me, I should say, which is that they won't come back, but they probably will. <laughs> I don't have a lot of confidence that they won't come back, but I still got them nonetheless, because if they do, if they are really truly going to be exclusive, then I want exclusive weapons, okay? Because I want them. But yeah, this weapon seems to be pretty decent. It looks like this definitely might be the best weapon you can get in the trader's van. So I would probably just recommend this one out of all the other ones. But at the same time, I don't like recommend blowing a bunch of gems in this trader's van. Because it's just not that great. It's kind of it's kind of mid-tier. But this man just wants me to take... Dude, you don't need to tell me to take the win. I always take the win anyways. I'm just that good. I'm just that good, okay? I'm just so pro at the game. Die. And... Oh. Dude, what happened to take the win? What happened to take the win, bro? What happened? What happened to take the win, bro? Seriously, seriously, I can't hit any shots with this thing. I think I might have turned up my sensitivity a little bit because, like, I just like did that spin move and I like way overshot. <laughs> so, yeah, um, I think I might end the video here now, guys. So just so I don't like keep rambling on about like random stuff. Uh, I think I've covered these weapons enough, so I think I will end the video. Um, if you guys found this video helpful, again, make sure to like smash the like button and subscribe so you guys don't miss a video from me and uh if you did enjoy i i'm too tired to like think right now i can't do an outro uh <laughs> thank you thank you guys for watching this guy has literally the same opinion as me it's the best one but still wouldn't recommend buying it um but yeah thank you guys for watching hope you guys all enjoyed and i'll see you guys all later bye bye